Um, I want to ask you first just about having Ashanti back on the field and um, just kind of what it means to you guys to see him back out there and kind of how do you kind of help him sort of get back into things? Um, it's going to help us a lot. You know, um, we're unsure if we're going to play this week, so but, um, it's going to help us a lot. It's going to give us a lot uh, more depth. You know, we um, possibly can move some more guys around and that, that help get them back on the field. So, I mean, that's going to, that's going to help us a lot. What about just getting ready for Arkansas State? And, uh, you know, the guys are saying they run a lot of trick plays, and that's kind of what you guys have been focusing on defensively is making sure you read your keys and, and stay on your assignments. Just talk about that a little bit. Yeah, um, as far as they go, I mean, we just got to do, do the things that we're supposed to do, you know. Um, I mean, they, they do try to do a lot of trick plays, but and you can't run all their plays in practice. So you just try to focus on the plays that um, that they have been successful with, and that's what, uh, what we have been doing. Um, I, I, uh, they kind of like Missouri, a uh, wide open offense. You know, they do a lot. They throw the ball a lot. So, I mean, for a first game, it, it ain't too different from us, uh, for from what we used to the past couple of years. The uh, your coach is getting on the defense a little bit and, and ran too well and at the scrimmage, you're saying tackling hasn't quite been there, hasn't been quite as sharp as they wanted. Uh, are you going to keep a close eye on that this Saturday? Kind of what are you interested in seeing what the defense is capable of? Um, firstly, I'm going to keep a close eye on during the week. You know, um, we're not able to tackle in practice, but I'm gonna make sure uh, the ball carriers are getting wrapped up, because I mean, that's that's the closest we're gonna get to a game type situation is on Tuesdays and Wednesdays of tackling. So we gotta make sure the ball carriers are studded up. And um, I mean, uh, we just gotta go out there and play. You know, um, tackling is really motion. You gotta want to tackle to, to be good at it. So I mean, uh, we just gotta make sure everybody want to tackle so we can be really good at tackling. Is there anything to prove as a defense? Um, I wouldn't say it's something to prove, but I feel like we got to go out there and prove something to ourselves, not to anyone else. So we just got because we know we can be a good defense. So, um, we just got to go out and do it. You know, um, it's not really about what other people think. We just got to go out there and play to our best of our abilities, and, and then we go from there. This is a start point, the first game of the year. Um, then we go out there, lay it all on the line, then see what we, see how things go, and then we go from there. What can you say about the group behind you this year compared to this point last year? Um, as, as a defense? Oh, just as a secondary, especially on the on the edges. Uh, we're a lot older, you know. Uh, um, we got some guys into some spots where they're more comfortable, like myself at cornerback. And um, we could do a lot more. Um, we bring five, six DBs on the field at a time. I mean, that's going to help us in this type of game because you know they obviously they go a lot of ten personnel, eleven personnel. So, I mean, we just want to get our best players on the field. And we feel like uh, the more guys we have back there, that's pretty good. We can, the more guys can be on the field. And last year, we weren't as confident. We had probably four, guys, four, maybe five guys that can play. Has there been anybody in particular in that second unit that maybe the last couple of weeks has really stood out to you? Uh, as on the whole defense or the secondary? Oh, in the secondary, yeah. Specifically people that are maybe behind you on the depth chart that you maybe didn't notice in um, last year. Pat Nixon. You know, he played cat safety behind uh, Shubo Sani. I mean, he's obviously been like a peak for a star spot, but I mean, he's he's keep getting better and he's trying to be uh, more of a leader and understand the game more. Um, Jack Ramsey, he's moved back to corner, so I me, mean, um, uh, I'm trying to help him along through that. But he's a great athlete, so I feel that he'd be a, be fine back there. So, I mean, those two guys in particular, and our uh, freshman Valden Cooper is going to be a really good player. Um, he, he, he knows all the positions just like I do. So, I mean, I feel like in the future he's going to be able to step in and play anyway.